This is my worst nightmare. Last time I snorkeled, I nearly died. <laughs> and you jumped in with all the stuff on. <laughs> I had no one told me you're not meant to put the flippers on until you get in the water. That was not fair. That's where we sleep. And that's the ocean. I'm never ever leaving here. And this should be funny. Pierre can't swim either, so. I'm actually just gonna jump in first. Careful, there might be coral down there, so go in slowly. Or gently rather. So yep, this is as far as I get when it comes to the ocean. <laughs> I look at it. It is, isn't it? <gasps> oh, that is beautiful. <sighs> I think, obviously, <laughs> that my filtered shot is better than yours. Mine looks like an art piece, like that could be... I know, be, I agree, I love that. That could be in an art gallery. I know, I agree, I completely love it. A minute ago she was like, my filter's the best. My filter is the best. Yours is rubbish. So I think what we're going to do, we're going to post both these shots <laughs> no, we're not. on one on my Instagram, one on her Instagram, and whoever gets the most likes wins. So I would much appreciate <laughs> it if all of you went over to my Instagram and hit like on my version of the picture because <laughs> she's going to win by default if you don't help me out. <laughs> and these are the two pictures we're talking about. So, right. So, this one is Pia's filtered shot. She done this in an app called Visco, which is a pretty good filter. I do, I must admit, I do like it a lot. And then I did this cool one, very, very, very cool one in Lightroom. And Pia wants to post this one. Because you can see the blue of the sky and the water. It's like important to show how blue the water is. It, I love his too though. She doesn't. Before I turned the vlog on, she was like, you're rubbish. You're lying. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, how about this? If you head to my Instagram and hit like on my picture and write the word dislike on Piers' picture. No, don't <laughs> troll me. <laughs> Don't tell people to troll me. <laughs> Don't do that. Just go onto my Instagram and just leave a comment, something like, you're so much better at photo editing than Pia. You should go onto Kane's Instagram, look at the two photos and say, Pia is always right. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't. Don't do anything. It's just... our motto. <laughs> <laughs> it's not our motto. I have an idea. If you don't like my picture, <laughs> I'm not going to release tomorrow's vlog. <laughs> I always get so awkward when people come and clean the room because I feel like I should help. So I just stand here, <laughs> sit weird. Doing some work. What have we decided? We've decided that we'll go with yours for your Instagram just to keep the peace. Yeah. But deep down, all the true art lovers on YouTube know that I was right. I know. Uh, it's fine. We're going to do your one. Your stupid filtered one that you did in your iPhone. Don't worry about my thousands of dollars worth of software on my Mac. Stop. <laughs> sure, sure you're Sulking. right. Sulking. <laughs> Don't try and schmozy up to me now. <laughs> You've offended me. So I think we may have come to a compromise. Let me show you what we've done. <laughs> this is Adobe Photoshop, if you don't know. It's a pretty good app for like editing photos and all sorts of stuff. Anyway, so this photo here that you're looking at, this is Pierre's one. And then, this photo here is my one. I've laid them on top of each other in the layers section of the app. What I'm now going to do is make this just 50%. So my image is just 50% over the top of Pia's. And boom, we have a compromise. It's a winner. So that's hers. That's with mine overlaid over the top at 50%. And I reckon that's a pretty good thingy-magic. Yep. All right, we're going to post that one. Compromised, guys. Aren't you proud of us for working through this? <laughs> oh, hey. Compromise. 
that's what happens when couples work together. <laughs> and so now we're going to post the same shot on mine and Pia's. So please. So just, just go, still just write, Pia is always right. <laughs> please. <No. laughs> That'd be really helpful. Just go like my version only. <laughs> What do you fancy for breakfast today, babe? I don't know. Bircher Musler here is amazing. But I don't know, I'm gonna walk around that uh, buffet and I have to do a full lap of the entire buffet first, just so I can like take note of all of my options and then I can make a educated decision on what I'm gonna have. <laughs> I'm seriously considering getting uh, a Sri Lankan curry. Oh, really? Well, it's our last day, so it would seem rude not to. <laughs> for breakfast? Yeah, why not? They're the toilets. I wish I could show you, but I think that might be an invasion of privacy. But they're <laughs> entirely open to the ocean. Not where you go, but just the, um, your view, should we say. Yeah, it's, so there's like no walls to it. Yeah, it's super disconcerting when you first go, but <laughs> once you get used to it, it's kind of cool. Mango ketchup, carrot ketchup, All pineapple the ketchup, banana ketchup, beetroot ketchup. <gasps> I. I actually did exactly the same thing in yesterday's vlog. Did you? I went nuts on the ketchups. <laughs> Have you tried them all? No. I'm going to try the banana one now. <laughs> Not a bad view for breakfast. Super cool. Little mini rotis and coconut curry. Whenever I'm in a foreign country, I always try and eat the traditional breakfast. It's a good idea. You learn a lot about the culture. And I love curry. Breakfast is done. We've got to leave in six hours, so we're going to try and squeeze in about 54 photo shoots. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Okay, I want you to get your drone. And I'm gonna run into the water and dive in, and you're gonna track me with the drone and then keep going out and showing the island. Are you taking are you taking the big bags? Yes, I think. Oh. Bye. Oh my god. <laughs> I really, really don't want to leave. It's so annoying, it's like 30 plus degrees here, <laughs> and in Sydney it's 30 plus degrees, but we have to dress like it's winter, even with jumpers, because the plane's going to probably be about 4 degrees. <laughs> yeah, I've got like spare socks and everything with me. Satu, thank you so much. So nice to meet you. That was journey, and I'll see you back again. 100%, thank, thank you. Thank you. Have thank a wonderful you. next adventure, thank wherever so they do. Yes. <laughs> Please, watch out this. This is one of the best places on earth, I think. Yeah, this is number one for me. Yeah, me too. It really is. I've never been to a more amazing place in my life. <laughs> just arrived at the airport in a speedboat. <laughs> it doesn't get much cooler than that. Gosh, we <laughs> We've travelled heaps. I've never actually heard like uh, hymns or prayers sung through public loudspeakers at certain times of the day. It's really interesting. I didn't know they did it here, but it's pretty loud. How do you feel about being in the paper, babe? <laughs> yeah, agree. <laughs> we just got to Colombo Airport in Sri Lanka and we've just seen that yesterday's vlog has made the paper. No mention of me, thanks Daily Mail. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently they have a butterfly garden in this airport but all I can seem to find is Pikachu. <laughs> This is 
seriously the coolest place. If you get to Singapore Airport, do make sure you come and check out Butterfly Garden. I dropped my phone! So we've been back in Sydney for five hours. We used most of that time to have a bit of a nana nap. <laughs> and, All of it. Yeah. <laughs> and now we've come out to the Grey Goose Boulangerie Blue Party. So let's go have a look around. That means blue bakery, by the way. Blue bakery! <laughs> and there's lots of baked goods. <laughs> A slushy made with grey goose. <laughs> it's so good. Mm. It's so refreshing because it's like summertime here now in Sydney. So this is epic. So we have just calculated that we have literally been awake for 54 hours now since we left the Maldives. So I think it's time for us to go home, hit the sack and get a bit of beauty sleep. Yeah, I agree. Because <laughs> tomorrow we have a really fun day. We're heading to the other end of the country. We're going to WA with Mazda. This might be the scariest four vlogs you're going to watch because Pia is driving for four days straight. You're so in safe hands. You're in safe hands. <laughs> 